Oh, just one week left until Christmas, or eight days actually. Millions of people turning to online shopping to buy those last minute gifts. But there are some deadlines you need to know about in order to get your gifts on time. Here now with what you need to know, PR and branding expert Chris Ruby. Thanks for joining us. Of course, thanks for having me. Online shopping has just changed the game completely. Yes, entirely. Um, it, it's really changed everything, especially because of social media. Um, you know, now you can just go online, see what your friends want. Instagram has become the new catalog, so you can see what someone else wants, like it, and then get it directly through tags, shoppable tags online. And now when you go online, I don't know about you guys, but you're starting to see those, you know, order now, get before Christmas. Right. Well, yeah, this is when people start getting nervous, right, Chris? And let's look at some dates here. If, if you're curious about when you got to buy something in order to get it on time for FedEx, uh, I guess the, the 21st? Yeah. The 21st for FedEx and, and for UPS. Wow, that's isn't that a little early? That's four days before Christmas. It but does yeah. seem early. Yeah. Well, it, no, it's, it's, it's okay. There's so a few other things. Make sure you too. get it there by the 24th, I guess. And then exactly. USPS for the Priority Mail Express, you got the 22nd, Amazon. Ooh, see, Amazon, that's why they win. Right, they got the right. 23rd. Same. You get a couple more days there and 24th if you do same day delivery. Yeah, same day delivery is going to be a, a big one for a lot of people who have waited to the last minute to do this. I mean, I often, though, feel like, uh, am I really risking it? Because you never, and there can be a storm. I mean, a million things can yeah. delay packages getting to you. There could be, yes. Uh, you know, the best thing, obviously, is to get all of this stuff ahead of time if you can. And also, you can always It's almost too late for that at this point, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, exactly. and, and online retail, I guess, is uh, still. Uh, improving as the as the makeshift stores are, are on the decline. So I think retailers have a really interesting opportunity right now. You yeah. know, retailers are no longer just selling stuff; they're selling experiences and yeah. Instagrammable experiences at that. So if you want to be able to compete with the convenience of online shopping right now, you have to be able to create an experience for something for holiday shoppers that's shareable and Instagram worthy. God, it's crazy that our world has become Instagrammable. It is, but that's what it requires. But you're so Instagrammable, Jillian. I mean, <laughs> no, you are. You are on my Instagram. <laughs> you know, the other thing here that's changed is um, it used to be a holiday tradition to go family, you know, to go mm -hmm. shopping with your family. Now everyone's on their phone shopping alone. So that's sort of a little bit sad. <laughs> or if you're with your family, yeah. you're still on you're your phone. All, yeah, you're all just looking at your phones instead of hopping in the car and going to the mall. So yeah. any last minute tips for people who are doing their online shopping? Last minute tip is go today if you can. Get it before the deadlines. Try and do what you can to avoid okay. Okay. The, the mess. Chris, thank you so much. <laughs> we appreciate you. it this morning. Thanks for coming in.